Uh, what's up? What's up, people? So, man, listen, man. Uh, this situation right here is um, uh, it's kind of embarrassing to me, and I feel a little ashamed. You know what I'm saying? I do feel a little embarrassed, but I gotta express myself because I see the YouTube scammers are on the loose again. Um, I was once desperate one time. I had hardly no subscribers on my channel. And somebody came along to me and they said to me, well, I reached out to them. They didn't come to me. And they said if I paid them a certain amount of money, that they was going to help me gain some of their following, subscribers and stuff. I think at the time I had seven subscribers. And off to the person, I might have gained 30. Maybe 30. But I thought I was going to get a thousand. That's what the person told me. But I only gained 30. And then the 30 subscribers I gained, they didn't even stick around. They left. So in reality, I gained no subscribers. And the bad thing about this, I paid this person 500 American dollars. Yes, I'm embarrassed to tell y'all that. But it's the truth. But I just want to let y'all know ahead of time a little about YouTube. It ain't no secrets to YouTube. It depends on rather you get the center stage or you don't get the center stage. But any content cre creators that's new on the platform, please don't let nobody fool y'all and claim that it's secrets that they're going to give you, the, the secret weapon to get a bunch of subscribers and to get a bunch of views. It ain't no secret weapon. And if you want to know anything about getting views and subscribers, it's hundreds, it's hundreds of free videos already on the internet for free. It's actual people that's telling you what to do who actually work for YouTube, and a lot of their videos ain't working. So it doesn't matter what the best keyword, it doesn't matter, it's just a challenge. And it's rather the algorithms give you some center stage. But I'm going to help y'all a little bit to understand the algorithm a little better. Consistency helps the algorithm to give other people opportunity to see your video. Like let's say you drop a video and you give the algorithm. You, they used to you dropping a video once a week. So if you drop this video once a week. The algorithm will take a chance and put your video up in front of more people to see how they react to the video. You know what I'm saying? So don't expect overnight success on YouTube. And it's no secret weapon to winning on YouTube. It's rather, I see people with a thousand subscribers get a hundred thousand views. I see people with a million subscribers getting 10, 12,000 views. So if you look at these people, YouTube pages, and you look at their channels, that should tell you right there that it ain't no secret to YouTube. The best secret I could give any content creator, if you want to build yourself on YouTube, you just have to be consi consistent. You have to take a chance and hope that the algorithm give you center stage. You have to be dedicated to what you're doing. You can't look at YouTube as monetization and you can't look at YouTube as money. You just have to love what you're doing. Love to deliver a message. What I'm doing right now, I just love to deliver a message to y'all. I'm not doing this for no money. I just see the YouTube scammers on the loose. So I'd rather give y'all some enlightenment before I understand because I was once a victim. I'm kind of embarrassed right now to tell y'all that. But they got me. The YouTube scammer got me. They told me that they was going to help me do this and help me do that. None of it worked. So any YouTuber that listens to this message and say, well, I'm not going to listen to you, take a chance just like me. I hope everything works out for you. I hope that the YouTube scammer is not a scammer anymore. But let me tell you something. Look all over and type in Google. Matter of fact, type in YouTube. What is the secret to being a successful YouTuber. And you pull up thousands of videos. Thousands of videos. Hold up. Even Mr. Beast got a video. 
one of the biggest on YouTube, even Mr. Beast. So if Mr. Beast, who you want to listen to with Mr. Beast? But listen though, we listen to all these different messages on YouTube and they tell us this and they tell us that, but it still doesn't work. Did you know that YouTube algorithm updates a lot? They change the algorithm all the time. So by them continue changing the algorithm, how could anybody tell you any secrets to YouTube that they can't control? They could tell you put better keywords in, that don't make a difference. They could tell you this and they could tell you that, that don't make a difference. When you get a YouTube channel, you need to do it for the love. But as you're doing it for the love, create better content. Continue to do better with your editing. Try to keep people in tune on what you're doing. That's the key to YouTube. Try to keep people liking your videos. Keep people interested in the topic, interested in the message. And if you could keep people interested in your message, YouTube, the algorithm, will put out to more people suggested videos. They're suggested to another person. Let's say somebody going, they type in Google right now, what to, how to become a, a successful YouTuber. If a good bit of people already have liked your video, the algorithm will suggest you to more people. So they might suggest you to that person. They look at your video, okay, boom. And you got to look at the retention rate. You got to see how long they're watching your video. If they're watching your video all the way through or mostly all the way through, then YouTube will keep suggesting you. The more they suggest you, the higher you go up the algorithm. So I'm just saying this message to y'all. Please don't fall victim like I did. I'm embarrassed right now to tell y'all that, but the YouTube scammer got me. And you know what? A lot of people not going to come on here and say this to y'all because a lot of people, you know what I'm saying? They feel embarrassed, so they'd rather keep it on the low. But if I could just save one life, if I could save one person from being a fool like I was, if I could just get one person to not fall for the trap like I did, don't be desperate like I did. I was desperate. I had seven, I think I had seven subscribers. And the person, basically, when I looked at how much subscribers they had, I said, I know I'm gonna get a thousand. I said, can you please get me to a thousand mark? The person said yes. Oh my God. I didn't get near a thousand. I was embarrassed. I was ashamed. Y'all people, be careful of the YouTube scammers. Because remember this. At the end of the day, the algorithms control everything. You can't scam the YouTube. You can't beat the YouTube. Only thing you could do is join the YouTube. But as you do what you do, I want everybody to know that in your progress, do the best that you could do when it comes to your videos. Keep on stepping your game up to the next level. You know what I'm saying? As you do what you do. I just want to light y'all as a YouTuber that felt that kind of pain. And I understand there's levels to this. And that's when you basically... Other YouTubers try to prey on smaller YouTubers because y'all look up to them so much. And when y'all look up to them YouTubers so much, they can almost brainwash y'all to do anything they want y'all to do. So y'all take your hard earnings and say, oh man, I'm going to be a big YouTuber because so-and-so say that they're going to help me do this and they're going to help me do that. That's not the way it works. I'm sorry. If y'all fall into that trap, and thinking that somebody got some secrets to YouTube, you're going to be in the same boat I was. You're going to be embarrassed just like I was. You're going to be ashamed just like I was. People, please don't fall into the trap of the YouTube scams. The honest truth is, it's up to the algorithm to give you center stage. It's that simple. It's not up to nobody, and it's nothing they can do about it. So I'm just telling y'all ahead of time. But if somebody so-called are able to help y'all to so-called get past YouTube and the algorithm, you let me know. Please give me a comment. 
Y'all have a great day and don't fall for the YouTube scammers. Real talk. Because they're out there to prey on people who don't know no better. I've been there, done that. This is just a message for the people. Hope y'all have a blessed day. Welcome to Africa, man. You know what I'm saying? Over here in the village with the kids. You know how we do it, man. Africa, you know, so this is the real deal. Welcome to Africa. You know what I'm saying? Just doing a little tour with the king of travel, man. We, we just making it do what it do. You know what I mean? That's word. Man, what's good? It's your boy King of Travel, man. We about to head to Africa, man. So y'all stay tuned, man. You know what I'm saying? Uh, going to Turkey first. From Turkey, we going to Nairobi, Kenya. Then we going to Mombasa, man. A real talk, man. Let's travel. All right, the King of Travel has arrived to the continent of Africa. Make sure to subscribe to his YouTube channel to get a tour of how the locals live in Africa. Let's start the tour in Nigeria, Egypt, South Africa, Algeria, Morocco, Kenya, Ethiopia, Ghana. Let's get ready to travel. My brother, what's your name, man? My name is Titus. Titus, man. Yeah, you know. Word, man. I just touched down Mombasa. You feel me? They drive on the opposite side of the road over here, something like Jamaica. Yeah, man, so we making the door to do, man. About to take me to my hotel. I got to get me some rest, man. I'm talking about my time is so messed up right now. I'm telling you, you know what I mean? So, man, we just touched down, Mubasa. Yo, what's good, man? It's your boy, the king of travel, man. I just touched down Mubasa, man. Say what's yes, good, bro. homie. Good, good, bro. My name is Dej Edward. This is my, my friend from America, yeah. So, I got a quick question for you all. Do you think life in Mombasa, Motwapa, Mombasa, Kenya, is people pretty cool out here? Is there a lot of violence? Is it, or people just pretty laid back? What's your, what's your intake? Tofa is cool. Tofa is good. It depends with your friends. Man, what's good, man? Just chilling out here on the streets of Lower City. Yeah, guys. What's up, man? How are you people? You're just chilling with my new friend, American friend on the streets of Mtwapa, Mombasa, Kenya, East Africa. African land, man. Welcome. Peace and love, eh? <laughs> Respect, man. Respect Africa, yeah, man. That's how we do it, man. Real talk, man. Welcome to Worldwide Traveling Off the Beaten Path News with Mr. Midas, the king of travel. Let's tour the world from resorts to some of the most dangerous hoods. Don't y'all want to see how the locals live? Let's travel.